In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, welcome to another Sermon Short. My name is Matt Waterstone. I have the privilege of serving as the senior minister here at the Reformed Church of Bronxville. And I'm grateful for the gift of your time, and I'm also grateful for my friends at De Palma Productions who do such a great job uh, producing these Sermon Shorts. And if you do me a favor, would you please forward them on to a friend? I believe that today you might be a blessing to someone else by clicking a forward button. If you've been journeying with us in these sermon shorts, you might remember that we've simply just been going verse by verse in Mark's gospel. Mark is the oldest of the synoptic gospels. It's the shortest. Mark gets right to the point. So I'll follow suit. Hear the word of the Lord from Mark chapter 1, verses 14 and 15. This is the beginning of Jesus' Galilean ministry. Now, after John was arrested, Jesus came to Galilee, proclaiming the good news of God and saying, the time is fulfilled. The kingdom of God has come near. Repent and believe in the good news. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. You know, friends, I find it really interesting that Jesus begins his Galilean ministry, his earthly ministry, with a message of repentance. In the Bible's native language, the word repent literally means to turn around and go in a completely opposite and different direction. If you are honest with yourself today, hold up the mirror, Be a bit vulnerable. What are some areas in your life that you need to repent of or from? That you need to go in a completely different direction? Could be an addiction. Maybe a short fuse. Quick to anger. A spirit that's quick to lie or bending the truth. Whatever it is, we all have things, dear friends, in our lives that need repenting of. And so, in fact, each and every week at the church, we take a moment, we offer what's called a a prayer of confession where we name those things. And I invite you to do that today. Take a moment and just say, God, I'm, I'm sorry. I long to repent to turn and go in a different direction so that we might better, dear friends, savor the good news of Jesus, that our sins are forgiven. Thanks be to God. Amen.